All right, this is Calibos, and we are playing Minecraft, and this, this is MC Eternal. So, um, last episode we set up this crazy thing. Uh, now we need to set up an attunement altar. The attunement altar is actually pretty sizable. I think we should be able to set it up in this region pretty well. So let's look for... Uh, I mean, I guess we could make the iridescent altar. altar. Boom. Here we go. So we got that. Now we just need a 19 by 19 space. We're going to go ahead and say um, one, two, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. I guess it comes out to there. we can do is what it is, right? Right. So the center of this thing, uh, let's see, let's go ahead and make, oh my God, 80. Uh, let's go ahead and make all the bits that we need. I think this is probably going Forty-one to be need four ruined marble. Uh oh, ah, I was worried there for a second. Four ruined marble. And we're going to need 80 marble arch. So that will be uh, a stack and 60. Then we're going to need. 225 sooty marble, 12 marble pillars. And then four chisels. Okay, so. that those why do I still have dirt in my hands Okay, we need 
to get our hands on some of coal. So 19, which means 10th uh, block. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. That should also be 10 from this side. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. That should be the same over here. Uh, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so this theoretically should be the middle. Uh, so starting in the middle, uh, this should be a sooty marble. I know, I know you're. All right, so alter go on that. Then we just need to go. So that's that's nineteen right there. So nineteen is gonna be this. So Get rid of the crafting table. Dirt again. Lots of dirt to get rid of. Uh, looking at this, we've got that corner. We need to go round circle. So that. So like this. Okay, that, that worked out well. Okay, so, um, Sooty marble. Let's grab a wand for this.
head. Let's grab another wand. Wow, we are just... Yeah, I think we're just going to have to make some more marble. Okay. Exciting. Okay, so that's all of that. What do we have left? So we've got four chiseled marble, four ruined marble, and then the pillars. So I'm going to look at this. Oh, maybe there's nothing in there. So ruined on the bottom, then the pillars, and then the thing. So uh, ruined pillars, and that. Color the. See, that's right. Okay, so theoretically this is done, and now uh, we got little sparkle things, so clearly this is actually finished. So we need to pick a constellation for everything to be attuned to. At this point, we need a telescope. Um, to the beginning and I I don't want to look at attunement thank you 
installation. Uh, maybe I do actually want to look at a tier. So. Need our perks. Alignment perks. By go undergoing a self attunement, some of the starlight energies that naturally imbue a body over time are forced into specific frequency granting magical abilities. While this initial starlight shaping provides a root for the magical benefits, also provides a manner to stretch those magical muscles into additional magical perks. Blah, 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 blah. Meditating, right? Uh, perk map to aid in whatever, unfortunately. Uh, uh, step in the right direction. Uh, far inferior to the ones found in blah blah blah. Study further. Ceiling. I I would really like it to. Show a list of the perks. You know, We can anvil name gateways. So maybe we should make uh, maybe we should make two of these gateways so that we don't have to keep uh, teleporting over. But yeah, we also want a telescope. Um, and then we get into the... Oh, you know what? I'm actually going to... Hold on. Oh, sorcery perks. Um, so there's a couple of different routes that we can start with. There's Avorcio, which is XP by breaking blocks. Avitus, which is XP by placing blocks. Fissio, which is based on movement. Uh, Amara, which is based on taking damage, which to be fair, I take a lot of damage. Uh, Decidia is based on doing damage. Um, I do like the added reach. Uh, 
Gosh, it's hard to say. So what I'm probably going to do is I'm going to roll the dice, and we'll work with that. that dice roller. Oh, 1d5. Oh. Okay, so we'll say that this one is 1, and I'm going to roll again. So that um, you couldn't see that, but I was pointing at uh, Avorcio. So going right around the circle, which would be Avorcio, Dissidia, Amara, Dissio, and Avidus being five. Roll the dice. It says D5. Oh, I have to actually. Says five, whatever five is. Uh, um, so five. So if this is a Vorcio, we are going to do a Vetus, which is uh, gain XP by placing blocks. So let's look at our thing here. Constellation, a Vetus. Oh, that's right. All of the freaking scrolls that we had saved in the book are gone. That's kind of annoying. So can we make an Avita scroll? Avitas. Um so we can so these are basically like just for these Uh, I think that we need spectral relays. So let's go get some gold. Oh man, you know what would be even more entertaining than uh Oh, you know what? We are not going to put a travel portal thing from Astral Sorcerer here. I I have got a much more entertaining idea. Um Kill it. Okay, there we go. Thing really quick. Silkworms can go away. Oak apple galls can go away. I will care about that at some point in the future in a time that is not now. But more important.
So we want relays. Relay. I think we just need four of these. That okay, so we want four of those, whack it with the whack and stick. These are just going to go, I guess. Um, now for the scroll. What did we say we wanted? We wanted uh, a Vetus. We'll need parchment, which is paper and thing. I mean, we have paper. We do. There's no. I will actually take them over there. Three. And we need those. That aquamarine gem, which gives us paper. So we need a feather to stardust. Paper. Oh, we can only make it on the iridescent altars, so... It is really irritating that we had them and we no longer have them because I can't... Keep, I can't not lose things. Okay, so what is the next altar? Uh, we need the iridescent altar, which is made with either, it has to be a celestial crystal. Uh, let's um, Okay, crystal clusters. Uh, 
far more useful to experiment with than the raw star metal ore. Little grains occasionally flash with light and sparkle while flowing. And la da 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 da. Louisville is rough coating and square one. Placing stardust into liquid starlight and subsequently tossing in a crystal seems to. Leaving this cluster to glow with starlight may create something much more useful, and these clusters seem to interact symbi symbiotically star metal ore oh 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 i remember so let's grab one of these Really? And now this is the one that I wanted in there. Of course. So this is the one that we want to drop right here. Okay, let's go get some iron ore. We'll break this and take it with us. So this is going to be a little bit, so what we're going to need to do is um, so we're going to want to put that there. We're going to want to get a linking wand. That, that is my linking wand. Tell me I have to make the stupid thing again. It's over there at the Astral Sorcery place already. I I, I took it out and left it here, didn't I? Okay, once more with feeling. Let's do this. So, uh, linking wand, we want to link you with that will start the conversion process. Then we want to go you and you. Then we want to go bucket. Wanna go bucket bucket. And we want to link We want to drop stardust. So I think that this should make a crystal cluster. I, I don't remember though. Uh, we'll give it like, oh, yep, there we go. 
crystal cluster. So now we just need to link that to that. So hopefully we're linking both the crystal and We want we want the block underneath to also to stay star metal ore. Um, which really, it is not doing. Uh, it could also be because it's daylight, but. This is a good place to call it. I hope you liked the episode. If you did, leave me a like. If you didn't, do not. Simple as that. Questions, comments, concerns, they all go below. And uh, yeah, you folks have a great night.